Hey, how's it going, friends? This is a look at the center of Chihuahua, the plaza. Right now, you can see there's a lot of, of little markets, um, people selling stuff. This is the historic center of Chihuahua. Please make sure you subscribe. I will be uploading more footage. You can see the cathedral there. It's a very nice center plaza here in the capital of Chihuahua with a lot of governmental buildings from the Spanish era. Anyways, this is just a quick look at the center. Make sure you subscribe. I will be uploading more videos. Well guys, this is the main cathedral here in the center of Chihuahua City. Very historic, very beautiful. I believe it was built uh, during the Spanish era. Of course it is Catholic. You can see um, there are a lot of statues of uh, Catholic saints. And yes, it's a very old building. A lot of people do come here to worship and uh, a lot of tourists come here to see the building. I'll go ahead and show you guys the front entry. I just want to show you some of the uh, details of the building. I could go inside but I don't think it will uh, be very uh, you know, reverent of me having the camera inside. There might be service right now. But yes, you can see people are setting up shop right now. Every now and then you'll see all these little shops here at the center. Um, they sell a lot of stuff, uh, a lot of indigenous uh, items, chains, necklaces, things like that. Um, it looks like there's some people actually that uh, might be celebrating a wedding or something here. But there's the entrance of the Catholic Church here, the cathedral from the Spanish era. Check that out guys, pretty amazing architecture what they were able to accomplish. You know, you see these historic buildings all around the world and uh, pretty incredible architecture. I'm not sure who those figures are, but that are uh, next to the pillars. They could be uh, the apostles. Um, these church bells do ring, I think, uh, at 12 p.m. and then sometime later at night. So again, I will be showing you around a lot of historic buildings. There's the water flowing. A lot of kids like to play in the water. There's the Congress building. I will be going around all these uh, statues they have and sort of talk a little bit about the history of Chihuahua. So make sure you give this video a like if you're enjoying this video, guys. I'm enjoying a Starbucks coffee right now. It's Saturday. There's not that many people right now since it's pretty early, but a lot of people will be here later in the afternoon.
Alright, I'm gonna break it away there. I'll show you uh, another video at some other place here in the center of Chihuahua. Let's go ahead and take a quick little stroll around the center plaza here, guys. And uh, let you take a look at the people here. Again, it's pretty early, so a lot of these shops aren't open yet, or they're barely setting up. There's a lot of cool stuff, belts, wallets, indigenous drinks, chains, I think they're gold-plated, stainless steel, chains. Here's a little garden area at the center where a lot of people like to come and sit in the afternoons. Usually you won't find people here right now because the sun is hitting them directly, but this whole area will be filled later on today. Looks like some uh, natural medicine here, some indigenous sandals, very beautiful. one of the main governmental buildings, guys. You can see the police. A lot of presence. They're on the bikes. Alright, so there's a little walk around the center plaza here. And I'll see you on the next on the uh, on the next take. All right, guys. So let's go down this street here. There is a lot more shops. Now, these shops aren't always here. Usually these tents aren't here. They just set up this weekend, so there's a lot of stuff for people to look at and buy. Let's go ahead and take a stroll down the street again. This is still the center of Chihuahua, so, you know. If you have your money here, you can definitely waste it rather quickly. It can be very tempting to buy a lot of these items, especially if you're just visiting here as a tourist. I usually don't uh, buy much from here. You know, I'll buy a bracelet or stainless steel ring or something like that. Check this out guys, here's a pretty cool map of the whole state of Chihuahua. Some pretty cool mineral rocks here. Some indigenous baskets. Yeah, so Chihuahua, if you don't know, is the biggest state in Mexico. It's pretty much like the Texas of the U.S., except uh, not as conservative. guys Chihuahua that's where we were just at at the center plaza down there if we continue there's a lot more there's a lot of books over here for a 
all you bookworms out there. You want some temporary tattoos? Like this is just a whole long line of books, guys. They're all in Spanish too. Which makes sense, of course. We are in Mexico. That's going to be it for this little walk, guys. So check it out, guys. I'm in a building here in the center. And uh, this is pretty much like the video game air area or the arcade machine area. Most of the machines in here are arcade. A lot of classic games, old school arcade machines pretty early right now so not a lot of people are here um, but uh, yeah usually later in the day you do see a lot of people playing these machines it's like these are some sort of gambling machines not good for kids don't recommend it We have a PlayStation 5, which I like to play, guys, but there's a kid playing it right now. Pretty cool. You're into the old school arcade machines. You can always come here and uh, spend some pesos. You know, have a fun time. area anyways that's gonna be it for those guys Check it out guys, they have a nice little Indian shop they just set up there with some Indian music and some pretty cool dresses. Uh, I'm just sitting here enjoying a drink, a kiwi drink. I'm gonna go ahead and walk around the cathedral one more time and see if I can go find a public restroom because I need to use the bathroom. So let's go ahead and take another walk. It is a little bit later in the day, so more people are here at the plaza. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead.
While the uh, kids still playing with the water, we're gonna go around the cathedral I showed you guys earlier. You'll see a quality inn hotel up ahead. A lot of the uh, tourists that come by here stay there since it's pretty much right at the center. Do you see a lot of people from the United States coming through Chihuahua here. It's a very nice place to visit. If you want to take a look at, uh, you know, one of the most, uh, not most, but a well-developed city. It's one of the main streets here. You see those tour buses. Those things will take you all around downtown Chihuahua and show you around. Have more shops over here, some nice boots, mineral rocks. We got another hotel here to the left, guys. Right dab in the middle of the plaza. Let's go this way. Get some drinks here, some some corn dogs. So you can see guys, there's a lot more people now in the afternoon. Right now it is 2 p.m. Saturday. Here's another look at this side of the church. But yeah, right around 5 p.m. It's going to be really packed. Sometimes there's some musical groups that will come and play here at the plaza. You actually get a lot of people dancing. It becomes like a little mini concert. We're going to go straight down this street here and go to that arcade area I showed you guys earlier. There's some public restrooms there, so that's where I'm gonna go ahead and go. You can see some people here trying to earn some money, showing off their talents. Now, I don't think I went down this street. Earlier, I went down the opposite street over there on that corner. This one doesn't have any any of those shops in the middle, but there are a lot of stores. Then to finish off this video, I think before I go back to the apartment, I'll go all the way down there and cross the street so I can show you the Plaza del Angel in English the Angel Plaza. So you can see the famous angel statue there in the plaza. Nice police officer there saying hello to the children. Let me know if you're enjoying these videos, guys. This will be my first video here in the capital of Chihuahua, Chihuahua City. Here's some stores. That one is called Cuidado con el Perro. Literally translated, be careful with the dog. <laughs> they have some pretty nice clothes there, actually. So you can see it's definitely a lot more packed right now than it was in the morning. This Saturday, so a lot of people come and spend their day out here. Just enjoy the weather. Enjoy the ambience, spend their well-earned money. <sighs> I 
you know, like in any city, guys, you're going to find people that aren't doing well economically. Especially here in Mexico, they will ask for money. But, uh, you know, they won't hassle you too much. If you don't have any to give, you can just say no and these people go on, go on their way. Do you see a lot of indigenous people here? They're called Tarumaras. You'll see them because uh, they're in their, their uh, cultural dresses. Very beautiful dresses, if you ask me. A lot of these uh, Tarumara indigenous people live live in certain areas around Chihuahua. Um, but they do come down here and try and make some money. Whether it's selling artifacts or, you know, asking for, for help. So we're getting close here to the arcade area where I was earlier. It's getting pretty hot out here, guys. But yeah, if you're thinking of coming down to Chihuahua, come on down, guys. Mexico is pretty safe. Of course, it's famous for cartel violence, but you only see that in the southern cities, and really, it's between them, so it's pretty safe out here, especially here in the capital. So here's the technological plaza, guys. I'm going to go up ahead and enter the public restrooms. So I'll see you guys later. All right, guys, I just finished using the public restroom there. Now we're going to go ahead and walk across the street from the center. I'm going to show you the Plaza del Angel, the Angel Plaza. And as we go over there, we're actually going to go past two historic buildings, governmental buildings, uh, again built during the Spanish era, as you can tell by the architecture. Very beautiful. They actually just finished cleaning up these buildings, guys. They're st they still are, actually. They were uh, graffitied by the protests that uh, were taking place here by the women that were protesting against uh, violence against women. You can see uh, this is the Federal Palace, and there are still graffiti on the walls. I believe those are names of uh, men that have carried out violence against women, so, you know, the protests are very understandable. It's unfortunate that, you know, they have to vandalize these buildings. But, uh, yeah, go ahead and give this video a like. Um, I'll try and go inside of these buildings later on in another video. They're very historic. You can actually go inside of them. This building here is where the founding father of Mexico uh, was actually executed for calling for independence. Uh, and his name is Miguel Hidalgo. So he was actually uh, executed here in Chihuahua in this very location there. There's actually some monuments to him explaining that. But as we can see here, right across from the center, from where we just came, we can actually see the Plaza del Angel, the Angel Plaza. And um, as you can see, there is the angel. Also, later on the day, you will see people putting their uh, you know, there are little shops here, uh, and, you know, they sell all kinds of stuff, just like we saw there at the center. Um, you can see some people are here early. But yes, very, very nice uh, plaza right across from the center here, guys. So there's the angel. I believe that is a male. Now... I believe that symbolizes independence, the independence of Mexico. 
and uh, unfortunately it was also vandalized during the protests. But yeah, guys, I believe that's uh, gold plated. Also at night, at the very tip of the sword, it actually shoots red lasers. So pretty, pretty cool, if you ask me. Let's go ahead and go up these steps. Now right now it's empty guys, but later in the day, this will also be packed. There's just not that many people right now. It's pretty early. It's 2.14 p.m. and uh, it's pretty hot right now. It's got to be around 28 degrees and that's not even as hot as it gets during the summer here. It can get up to 40 degrees Celsius. So you can see, guys, right across from the street, there is the Plaza Mariachi, Mariachi Plaza. There's some restaurants. A lot of people go inside there and enjoy some drinks. We do have some uh, sort of uh, carvings there of the history of Mexico, which I will try and show you. I can't fit everything into this video, guys, um, but I will be... I will be making a lot more videos here of Chihuahua City. Up ahead you can see the, uh, the hills, some of the hills of Chihuahua. Very beautiful, guys. In the state of Chihuahua we do have, I believe, the largest canyon in the world. They're called the, uh, the uh, Minas de Cobre, which I believe translated is um, the bronze... Uh, the Bronze Canyon or something, something something of that sort, but it's actually a lot bigger than the Grand Canyon. A lot of people don't know that because of how popular the Grand Canyon is. But yes, you can see here, guys, look, this is what happened with all the protests. Uh, pretty much they graffitied uh, these monuments, these governmental monuments. Like I said, that building down there was also graffitied all around. Um, but uh, you know, they just finished cleaning it up. You know, it takes a while. But yes, there it is, guys. Angel Plaza down here. All of this is filled uh, later in the day with people selling all kinds of items. Anyways, I think that might be it for this video. Please give this video a like, guys, and make sure you subscribe if you enjoyed it. Let me know if you think, uh, if you're thinking of traveling to Chihuahua, if you like uh, what you saw, or if you like to visit someday, or maybe you've been here already. Let me know your experience down below in the comments. Um, if I do record another little bit, then it will be added to this video. All right, maybe I'm not finished just yet. I'll go ahead and uh, give you another, another little view here. As I walk back to the center, don't think I'll be here too much longer. It's pretty hot and it is my day off, so I do want to enjoy some time back in the apartment, but who knows? We'll see you guys some toys there if you're into uh, collectibles check it out guys another little plaza right down here you can go ahead and sit there and grab some shade very nice and we do have to wait for the lights to turn red so we can go ahead and cross Not too much traffic right now, but there will be a lot more later on. <laughs> so there you
There's that plaza, guys. back to the main center area. All right, I'm gonna try and walk back to the center and then I think I'll wrap up the video there, guys. Enjoy. of books in this area. Looks like it's a lot more empty on this side. <laughs> 